Alright guys, I'm about to have breakfast. Do you like a Possiamo andare in via San Luca per cortesia. Grazie. So I started modeling when I was six years old actually. Um, I was scouted by Giorgio Armani. And I had like a, some sort of a career when I was a child. In recent years I picked it up again. And it's been very good ever since. I started teaching mathematics at University College London at the beginning of my PhD when I was only 21 and uh, I would have never thought that I was going to become a teacher. First, I never realized that people were taking pictures in the classroom, and uh, the first time is when I saw, saw it reposted on Facebook. And it sort of happened a few times until I think the Daily Mail picked it up and reposted it, and it just went all crazy on the internet. I was all over the internet. I literally saw myself everywhere just because people were sending me links and pictures, and you know, everyone's getting in touch. And I was top trending on Facebook. I started like having more people showing up at the class, like people who had nothing to do actually with the course. The fitness was a big part of my life because it actually helped me with my work, you know, it kept me focused and motivated during the day and obviously like healthy. I'm the sort of person who needs to be always busy. I'm not a procrastinator. I don't like to waste time. I'm Italian, so I eat lots of pasta to keep energy. The modeling also helped me because when I was working in academia, it's very intense work uh, intellectually. Uh, you know, in the fashion, everything is more dynamic and uh, fun and creative. And uh, so it's good, I think, to have a balance in life about, uh, between different elements uh, of what we're doing. Well, that was a really nice day together and it ended in the best possible way with an awesome workout. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, I'll see you soon. Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It has been a while and especially it's been a while since my workout videos Specifically, I'm talking about exercise anatomy, which was the most successful of all, has amassed millions of views, and for which I'm very thankful to you, actually. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. Today, I have great news for you. In the last year, or year and a half, I've been writing a new series. And this is going to be called Strength Science, and I have accumulated all my knowledge, all my notes, all my experience from years of working out to create a new series, the most advanced workout series out there on YouTube. So if exercise and athlete was good, this is going to be great. And it's all ready to be filmed and produced, but now I really need your help. So we only to cover the production costs and the editing, the special effects that are going to make this series great, I need your help. So for this reason, I set up a Patreon page and I set up a goal on the Patreon page. So if you can pledge your support, any support, I can then, you know, eventually produce this series, hopefully very soon, and get it out there and premiere it together with you. So once again, I'm going to put my link to my Patreon page, pledge anything, help out, 
participate to the polls and receive additional benefits by the way. I'm also going to give to all my patrons additional benefits, extra content, behind the scenes, daily like updates, polls. You'll see. Just check out the page and uh, I'll get to work and we'll get to work and get some good work out together. Thanks a lot. I am Pietro Buzzelli and I am the founder of Petra Design. My top three tips for a successful workout. The first one is definitely strength training. Anyone who wants to improve in any sports they're doing and if you want to maintain good posture, good strength, strength training is the number one. The number two tip would be to work on what motivates you. In the long term you need to find something you're really passionate about. And then number three, well obviously it's important to look good when you go to the gym. This is why I started a sports brand. There's a lot of research that goes into that, making sure that the garments not only perform well, but they also produce in an ethical way and they're better for the environment. Living an active lifestyle is becoming part of our culture. And everybody understands that having a healthy body helps having a healthy mind. And the two things go hand in hand.